Hey, it's Pete Preston again, and today is day 30 of our 30 Days of DevOps video series on the Form Builder in Jira Service Management Cloud. I am so thankful to you for being here with me for this whole journey. If you haven't watched all of the videos in this series, there is a playlist here on YouTube. So please go check them out. Bookmark it. It's a great reference. I hope it's useful for you. Now, this last video, I don't really have anything to show you. It's going to be a bit more of a recap, not a nostalgic thing, but more about the features that you have that you know about now and what you're going to do with them. And I think it's important for us to take a step back and, and realize that there are a lot of ways that you can use forms in Jira service management. We've covered everything from the rich text formatting that you have right here. So if you're familiar with Confluence and you've edited a document there, you can build a form. We've also talked about the templates, which you can see on the screen here. You have your choice of starting points. If you're not sure how to get going when you're building a form, the templates there, we now have 329 of them, are a great place to start. We've also talked about all of the validation rules to make sure that you can get the information that you need from customers in the right format so that you can trigger things like automation. You can work your systems and you can do that reliably and you can kind of sit back and comfortably know that the data that you're getting matches what you need. We've also talked about things like automation. There are four new automation components for your form builder, and we will be adding more of those to make that more and more robust and make that an integral part of your workflows. We also talked about the form building guide. There is a great way of structuring your forms and asking questions and making sure that you're giving your customers everything they need so that they can answer your questions and provide you with the data that you need to run your systems, to run your workflows, and really at the end of the day, to do your work, to get back to them, and to provide customer service in a high velocity way. Now, if you have any questions about the new form builder, the features that are coming out, the features that you have today, please join us in the forms group on the Atlassian community. Just head over to the community, search for forms, or go to groups and find the forms group. I'll be in there. The product team will be in there, some content designers. We've got a great team behind us there answering questions. We're trying to make it a very lively place for you to be, to ask questions and to get everything that you need to build the best forms that you can so that you can just run your business using Jira Service Management Cloud. Thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful. Again, please bookmark the playlist and come back to it anytime you need it. And hey, share it with a friend or colleague who has questions about forms. I hope we've answered their questions here, but if not, Come to that forums group and let me know what else you'd like to learn about.